make the perfect side dishes for your cookout. Greg Hare from Stratford University is joining us this morning with more. We are in grilling season now. Yes, it is we are. official. That is correct. So we need some good side dishes to go That's with it. That's right. Everybody has their hamburgers, their hot dogs, their sausages, their chickens. Stuff. Yeah, all that kind of stuff. Um, a lot of times people I did, went with a classic little green bean casserole. Yeah. A lot of times people take the green beans, add some condensed soup to it, and there's a lot of salt and other ingredients and I things do. like that. Yeah. And I'm just going to show you a nice, easy way to actually make that soup nice and economical. I mean, less than five dollars right, for see. the whole thing so yes we're gonna have you put me to work let me know okay. if I can help you you can throw the butter in <laughs> all right should I use this by all means on? go right, right. ahead so no butter flour and just a little not, bit of flour not, not, not yet not yet oh. we gotta let the flour let the butter melt but that's okay that's quite all right already off to a bad start shame right? on you <laughs> now see this is why I need you this here. is my former chef so you'd get a knife thrown at your head see see and that's you not... guys are are the best we're just trying to learn <laughs> So once the butter melts, okay. and it should have been soft a little bit, but yeah. I did that wrong too. No, that's okay. You didn't do it. I wrong. better come to your school here and learn a little no bit. No kidding. <laughs> so we're gonna let that melt down a bit. Okay. And of course, our wonderful butter is not cooperating, but that's okay. Now that we have it nice and melted, now you can add that flour. Now we put this in. And, and again, you you're know, right. This is these are simple things that we correct. have in our kitchen right now. Correct. And do you know what we're making right here? Um, tell me. <laughs> this is called a roux. Okay. Okay. And once we make the roux with the butter and the flour, mm -hmm. now we have a nice hot roux. We're going to take some cold milk. Yep. And I'll let you pour that in as I whisk. Hold on okay. one second. I'm going to listen carefully okay. this time. Now we're going to use a whisk so when we add the liquid, when we get lumps, the whisk will break up the lumps. So okay. go ahead and pour it. Sure. Pour, and pour, what pour. Kind of, is this skim whole? What? This is whole milk. If you again, you want to cut down the fat, you can use 2%, 1%, skim. Okay. Either one works. The whole thing is going to go in. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's pretty simple. It is pretty simple. I, mean, I would have never thought to make my own. I, I, I told you, I would have just grabbed just, a can of soup. And, and what, what do we put in? Here it is. We're all, and Flour, all we have to do, milk. correct. And all we have to do is now wait for it to boil. Mm -hmm. Once it does, we're going to get something that looks like this. In it's this a case, thicker. it does get a, the starch gelatinizes. It gets nice and thick. Mm -hmm. And then we have our cream soup. Looks like that stuff you get out of the can now, Definitely doesn't it? Definitely does. Okay. Without so, all that salt. Without all the salt. Without Very all smart. the binders and all that kind of mm -hmm. stuff that they need um, to put in the canned product. Then we have some cooked mushrooms. Yeah. We're going to put that in. And now we have our cream of mushroom soup that we get out of that can, right? Very smart. That's crazy. All right. So then, and it only takes total time for this to boil, maybe five, six minutes at, on high. Right. And as long as you're stirring with a spoon and keeping it from burning on the bottom, everything's cool. You add in the green beans and add then I the think you beans. put yours in the oven, right? Correct. For how long? Just to brown it off, um, about five, ten minutes at 350. Right. Put the onions on top and you're okay. good. Greg, this thank exactly you it. so much. Thank you. We learned a lot here today and if you want to actually get this recipe, please go to our website, foxbaltimore.com slash morning. Thank you so much. Thank you.